What's going on guys, Rico6801 here, and I've been really, really busy here lately. I know I haven't put out a whole lot of YouTube videos, but uh, I did get the MAME going, as you can see behind me, and that was kind of a pain in the neck. So what I decided to do was to make this video trying to help other people that are trying to get their computer to connect to maybe an old style TV. So you're going to need two things. You're going to need a card like this. And you're going to need a video, well, it's an S-Video 7-pin adapter that looks like this. So what you're going to need to do is hopefully have an old computer laying around, order the video card and the cable, and set it all up. And then when you get it all set up, the thing that I had to do, I had to put splash top on it because it's going to try to output in like a progressive scan. And this is 480i. And so with Splash Top, I was able to go in and set the settings to 480i, and then it smoothed out the picture as you see behind me. So anyway, you're going to need an old style uh, ATI Radeon, I think it's a 3450, it used to be in all the old Dell models. And then you're going to need a 7-pin S-Video to uh, component, and then you connect it to the, to the TV if you deboxed one and, and did like I did. Uh, if you didn't, then you'll still have the capabilities to, to run whatever. Um, it comes with an odd splitter for VGA. It splits uh, the signal into two VGA ports, so that's the only other odd thing about it. But if you have another video card that has a 7-pin S video, it should be able to output and component. So. If you guys have questions, if you have comments, whatever, feel free to ask me. I know how big of a nightmare this is because I just fought it. And uh, I hope this helps to some degree because it was a nightmare. But it was really, really inexpensive versus buying a HDMI to component converter, which can run you 50, 60, and up. Um, I wanted to be able to do what I wanted to with what I had and that's what I had and it was on the cheap so um, feel free to ask me any questions comment and as always I'll catch you in another one peace